Smoke. Good morning again, and uh, welcome all you YouTubers and all my people who subscribe to me. Um, this is another gripe session against Microsoft, the people you love to hate. Uh, like I said in my last video, um, I came across um, um, some information on all the um, uh, Microsoft updates that you don't want it to install. And um, I was able to get into my old computer that was killed by Microsoft uh, in safe mode. And I found, I took um, each download that um, I, um, the last time I uh, downloaded everything, I went through every uh, update uh, line by line. And I uh, came across four. Four very buggy um, updates, and um, even though it didn't help the computer to get to boot, it's still, for some odd reason, um, there's still a, um, something in in one of those updates up there. It's keeping it from um, um, booting up properly. But it just seems funny how the last time that I shut down that there was six downloads that I did not um, authorize and then the next day my computer doesn't boot up it just goes into an endless loop um, the information I received was uh, uh, greatly appreciated from um, let's see what is it welcome to pixel trail community forum and they have um, uh, all the Windows 7 and updates seven and eight updates to avoid and um, like I said there was four of them on my old computer and for the, the best part I am um, I decided to go into my new computer because I know there's three there that were downloaded that I didn't download and they um, they were on June June 5th and believe it or not out of the three I found one and it was the same one that um, um, KB3072318 uh, for Windows um, 8 and 10. Uh, there was one on there, so I deleted those. And it seems like I got a lot of um, updates to do on my new computer. Um, and I guess I'm going to have to take line by line and see which ones I can download and which ones I can. Um, it just seems like really Microsoft is really screwing over the entire uh, computer community. And uh, as I said before, there was one um, um, story that I read where a guy was doing Call of Duty and Microsoft messed up his computer to the point he lost nine hours of gameplay. Nine hours. I would be frustrated as heck, and I would be having uh, be so livid up there, blood would probably be shooting out of my eyes after doing all that work because uh, Microsoft's toting one. Oh, we have millions and millions and millions of people uh, with Windows 10, but it doesn't. They all, like I said before, they don't tell you that this Windows 10 is being crammed down our throats. And it's totally unfair to all of us who use computers that have to put up with this crap. It just seems like um, the same situation um, is happening to uh, uh, us computer users um, from Microsoft like it was with the Volkswagen um, snafu about them lying about their uh, diesel uh, mile power or uh, ga gallons per or mile well whatever you know, like I said it's it's four o'clock in the morning out there and uh, this is what time I usually get up so I need some more coffee I know that and they um, yeah, lied about um, um, their fuel ratings that's what I'm trying to get at and it just, just doesn't seem to be any different um, uh, we got our hand into some companies up there that um, uh, what ex what extent they'll go to 
to achieve their means. And they don't care how many people they step on, how many people's computers are ruined. And like I said, I've been reading more and more. Matter of fact, there was a, uh, the other day I was looking at um, um, a YouTube video up there with this, a young kid. I had to play it twice to get the full idea where he was coming from. It sounds like he was defending Microsoft. And all I can say is, boy, that kid's naive as can be. Because uh, uh, he doesn't know half of what's going on with this uh, get Windows 10 crap. Um, it's either destroying computers or messing up people's computers to the point where uh, they don't want Windows 10. You know, because it's nothing more, from what I read, it's nothing more than malware spy bot. You know? And um, that's one reason why... Uh, even with my new computer, I, I, I'm not on it as much as I was with my old Windows 7. Um, I'm more likely to um, use my um, Asus Chromebook my wife got me for Christmas because uh, hopefully Microsoft's fingers is not fooling around with it. But, you know, you never know about them. Um, also, too... Um, I had gotten a um, another Windows 7 update, or not update, but um, uh, software that uh, I may end up having to scrub um, my Windows 7 computer and reinstall Windows 7 on it again. And therefore, that will lose all my data, even the 25% I was able to retrieve. The biggest problem I had was um, my CAD designs, uh, for my bicycles, um, pictures that I use for references uh, off uh, uh, the internet, such as uh, steampunk bicycles, steampunk ideas. A lot of those, I wasn't able to uh, download them to a jump drive because it said something about, if you download this, you'll lose all your properties. Well, I didn't think anything of it at first, but whenever I tried to uh, look at them on um, my new computer, a lot of the folders up there, there was nothing in them. So therefore, those particular files and folders are lost. And um, I'm going to try and see if I can, um, I have to get me another um, copy of uh, a Cronus backup because the one I got doesn't work on 8.1. So there's some more expense I have to go through in order to try to save my data. Uh, I tried... Um, uh, using my old version 2010 and that didn't work it wouldn't even install so right now I'm kind of at a standstill and um, basically frustrated as can be yeah gotta have me another cup of coffee oh man it's that good that starts the morning off great and um, I will try to put it in my description up there of what uh, this pixel trail, um, the uh, the link to it as much as I can. Whenever it printed off on my paper up there, it didn't print it all off. But um, this will give you an idea of what to look for, and you can use this to um, check on your updates and see which ones not to install. And um, so, until um, next time, uh, this is Michael from Desert Viking wishing you a good day, and I hate Microsoft. And yeah, dishing Microsoft and drinking coffee, and I'm all out of coffee. See you next time.